working on. I was trying to make a jet that actually flew and took off, and uh, this design has been evolving for the past hour or so, trying to achieve uh, a stable flight. And I did manage at one point to actually lift off and actually fluke for quite a ways, but I really couldn't control it, and so I added in uh, this nice little swaying thing in the back here, and I have essentially two different switches. Those push me down, and then the uh, switch one actually thrusts everything forward. And uh, essentially, what has happened <laughs> now, as a result, is that I can no longer I can no longer take off how it was. It was perfect almost, uh, and then I broke it somehow. And the thing is, I had an engine, and they were these uh, back th tur turning thrusters were essentially getting me stuck and allowing me to spin in circles. Let me just see if I can do it here. I gotta, I gotta get flight. F I gotta, I gotta get off the ground first. Here we go. Oh, it's not gonna happen. Maybe it will. This is a very derpy design, and it's actually quite stable uh, on flat ground. Okay, here we go. So once you start taking off, what happens is the uh, thrusters in the back, you can kind of hear it. Uh, the thrusters in the back get stuck on the engine when they turn all the way around. And they're not right now, and so I'm actually capable of flying through the air. Uh, I, I mean, kind of well, uh, if you like doing barrel rolls constantly. <laughs> I mean, it it's not too bad, but... Uh, I can't get it to stabilize, and uh, I think that, oh, I hit the skybox. I think it has to do with these back thrusters getting stuck on that engine, because they get turned all the way around. And so I do have this to kind of kind of stable uh, stabilize you, and, but I mean, essentially it flies, but it's all due to an accident now. I had, I actually had successful flight. Uh, but it no longer is actually uh, a controllable type of thing. It's just all due to this accident of uh, the thrusters getting spun all the way around here and getting stuck on the engine. And so what I thought maybe we could do is actually try to get this thing to take off in a relatively uh, decent manner. And I think the way that we can do that is to have another set of switch, uh, another switch that essentially has a, a, an upward thrust. And so we're going, I want to work on this right now. Okay, so I don't, I'm not entirely sure if this is going to work. I've only experimented a little bit with these uh, like upward thrusting type of deal. And so uh, we'll see if this actually works out. I hope it does. What do we do? Three? We just need to get off the ground, essentially. And so if I can make it, you know, somewhat evenly balanced, I think we should be okay. And also, I mean, this could help the overall flight process, too. We might find that having having it all on at once actually works well i mean there's only there's really only way one way to find out some people actually think through their designs before they hit the record button <laughs> oh but hopefully uh, you guys still enjoy the video i just like having fun and so far every time that i've just kind of messed around i've actually had pretty decent uh pretty decent creations except for the crap tashin crap taction contraption device what the heck am i even saying okay so i'm recording once again it's like 11 30 and uh i thought that if my other stream and uh my recording was any uh uh significant uh indication of the fact that i should not record late at night then i don't know if i'll ever learn my lesson oh that's three okay so three all right, so we need quite a bit more thrust. Probably gonna need some thrust off of here too. Gonna need some thrust coming off of here like that. And then, whoop, whoop. And then some thrust like this right here. Yep, yeah, that looks good. That's looking good right there. Okay, let's drag it over here. I probably shouldn't do impersonations, uh, impressions. 
That is... Well, as long as it's even on this side, we'll be fine. Is That's all that matters. Okay. That's that right there. And... That's that right there. Okay. What did I just say about impersonations? Impressions. I shouldn't do them. They just don't. I just can't do them that well. It just doesn't work out too well. Okay. 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 So we don't flip over in the front. Oh, it's beautiful. We have a lift off, folks. We have a lift off. Oh, okay. I saw that coming. Oh, uh, I have a great idea. We, I have a great idea. Oh, what? Whoa, it's making some funky noises. So, oh, he got on us. Okay, so that's like all of that's pretty much, pretty much useless. Honestly, it is. It's just useless. It doesn't do anything for us. There should be like a thing to see how long you could stay in the air because I'm win it right now. Look at this. This with this one, I've got a one right here. All right. This is a pretty uh I mean it's it's nothing it's nothing to look at, but it's uh it's not too bad. I mean, oh, I overcompensated. Gosh, dang it. Yeah, it's not too bad of a design. I mean, it kind of works for what you need it to, and you can even drive it. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Taking it off this little thing. And then phew, You know, that's actually pretty effective. Well, you know what would be even better is if we had um if we didn't have all of these thrusters and we just had a couple hooked up, then what we could do is we could actually we wouldn't have to You know what? Let's just experiment. Because we can always put things back, and I don't know if I have it. I can't, I can't, I literally can't tell. It looks like, it. we look good. We look good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, we got an issue. We got an issue. This one's not hooked up. Okay, so let's see what this is like. So now we just have basically a giant vehicle with a bunch of weight and a car that can't turn for crap. It can when you're going though, but the wheels are not in a good position now because it's too top heavy, too front heavy I should say. All right, so now it's a little bit more controllable. And then we could take, oh yeah. Oh no, it was working. It was working. Okay. We're still we still got too much thrust in the back. Uh I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what else to do with this design, guys. Uh it it somewhat works and it also somewhat doesn't work. <laughs> and uh things are a little bit crazy with this thing. But uh I I I just wanted to mess around with it. And see what I could get. Look at my feet. <laughs> my feet are through the bottom of the thing. Oh, I've like changed this thing like 40 different times since I started designing this vehicle. And now it's just like not doing anything that I wanted to do anymore. Oh, it was fun while it lasted. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this kind of just derpy video. Just me messing around trying to make a, uh, a nice little jet car. And, uh, you know what, I, I have some ideas for something we could do, but it's going to take a little bit of uh, setting up to uh, get it to work how we want it to.